some quick fire questions, if, we, if you don't mind. Yep. A song you're most proud of in your life? Well, I mean, I'd probably have to say Don't Dream Is Over because um, it's not because I think it's, it's, an, it's a superior song to some of the other songs I've written, but because it seems to have done so much in so many situations to bring a bit of comfort and, um, you know, joy to people. So, yeah, I'm, I'm really proud of that. The song you're most proud of on this new album, Out of Silence? I'll answer that for you. It's Second Nature. You've done very, very well with that song. Okay, um, great. I, I've had, there is a song which is really unlike anything I've ever written called Widow's Peak, which I'm really excited about. It just has an unusual atmosphere. It sounds ancient. Mm. Your favourite chord? Well, E flat is, is probably my favourite key. It's a rich key. Uh, I remember when I wrote Don't Dream It's Over, um, Mitchell Froome, it was an E, and Mitchell Froome suggested, why don't we put that down to E flat? I think it might sound richer. And he was right. It yeah. sounded way better. Um, Kiwi artists that jump to mind if I say legend. Um, oh, yeah, John Rawls. John Rawls is good. Um, overseas artist that springs uh, overseas artist that springs mind if I say legend. Oh, uh, you know Paul McCartney. He's Paul coming McCartney. to town. Yeah. Yeah. Couldn't be better than that. Johnny Marr. Johnny Marr. Your yeah, friend. Absolutely. Um, best place to perform live in New Zealand and why? I love the fact that I live just down the road from the power station, and um, I think it's in a really great venue. It's like. Uh, every time I've ever played there, I've had a great time. And it's just one of those rooms that's just big enough to feel like it's a real event and just small enough to feel like you're really close to the action. Ideal gig, small, intimate, large or rocking? Have no preference. They're all fine with me. I, I like being in this room performing. I like being in a, you know, I can perform in a stadium and have a great time. Or in front of the Sydney Opera House, you know, something. Yeah, like Sydney Opera House, yeah. but no, I, I, it just depends on how well you play and whether the audience are up for it, you know. Your musical mentor? Musical mentor. I wish I had one. I don't. Mm. I, I, that's one thing. I'm sort of living at the far end of the earth. I. Mm. I, I don't mean to downplay anybody's influence in my music, mm. but I. Um, I sometimes am up alone up there with my um, songs, and I wish I had somebody I could call. Um, a perfect day for you. A perfect day for me is where I um, get to play music, and my family are around me, and I get to have a swim in the ocean. Um, that's about it, really. And finally, Neil, your favourite spot in the world? I'm going to be there in a week's time. And uh, it's, I'm not going to give away exactly where it is, but it's in the, in the warm waters of the Mediterranean.